What is your biggest goal? Music I can express myself and it, I can uplift others with my expressions. Share this gift. Everyone has a gift from the universe. Life is more beautiful. And what's your talent? My favorite types of people are people who have gone through something and came out on top. Where all this strength come from? They discovered me. If you think you're working hard, then work hard. We call our clients VIFs, very important friends. It's all about the experience. I never thought that to leave do an interview for them. It's very rewarding. Without the help of the creator, I would not even exist. It's all due to him. Life is it's a week. Have this life. Make it happen. I'm gonna put you in my spot. Yeah. To rap for us. It's important to bring people together. I'm actually very to success. Lice out here in the lake. Your food treasure. <laughs> treasure from Brazil. You're it. Oh. <laughs> I'm available 24 hours. Here for you. You're getting better. <laughs> it's not easy. <laughs> Obrigado. Thank you so much for having us here at your house. To you, my friend, I wish you all the happiness and success. Let's go back to the interview. Our guest today comes all the way from Italy to Hollywood, California. A dancer, a singer, a host, and also a licensed boat operator. Yep, you heard it right. She also knows Brill. With us today, Chiara Basile Fasolo. <laughs> Thank you, Lise, for inviting me. Thank you for being our show. So you have to explain to us a licensed boat operator. How did that happen? Oh, Lise, I always love the sea. I grew up near the sea. I'm not far, like 20 minutes. And always I'm enchanted by the sea. And I, I like driving the car. So I said, why do not drive the boat? I want to be free. I want to be, sure. you know, in Italy, usually it's for men. So the training was 50 men and a girl, just me. It was kind of funny because it's for men usually. But I said, I want to do it. I want to be free. I want to drive. Women power. Yeah. So yeah, kind of freedom, kind of be yourself and yeah totally oh, yeah. and you also acted like in tv series and you name it like theater plays films shows especially yeah. tell us about your experience how did it begin oh well uh for first i have to say that since i was very young seven years old i was taking the camera of my father an analogic one in the 90s <laughs> and i was shooting with my friends just kind of just for fun, yeah, because I always love acting. When I was teenager, I said, I'll go move to Rome. And for sure, this is my career. This is my life. So this happens when I moved to Rome. Well, for first it happens when I was 13 in Pisa. There was nothing to do because it is not a city for, it's just a tourist city. A medieval city, but no entertainment city. And I said, Wow, I want to do something and if it doesn't, doesn't exist, I'm going to do it and to make it. And you also hosted a TV channel, Frigo, about cooking, Italian food, you guys know what you were doing. So tell us more about it. Oh, Frigo was a kind of very funny experience, but I can say delicious because we had a very delicious Italian food from north to south. And we, we, we say, we, we tell about the history of the food because some food come from the Romans 3,000 years ago. Amazing. Amazing. And we can still cook and eat, imagine. And so it, it was delicious. But a part of this, Frigo was based on the history of the food and how to cook and the uh, uh, Italian healthy food. So it was a funny experience and every, um, Every episode, my character changing. I mean, I was wearing different clothes, and yeah, it was it was very like fun. different styles to be different every time. But it was it was funny. And you played so many different characters. Among all, what's your favorite so far? It's a difficult question because I had so many roles and so different from each other. But my favorite thing was the one I played in this famous TV series. 
about, that just was about Kate's um, teenager with illness and cancer. And it was a pregnant, a pregnant mom, young mom, with this baby, and this baby was sick. So imagine you're giving birth to a, a baby that you don't know if he will survive. Lots of emotions, a lot right? Of, yeah, that's true. I, I'm not a mom, so it's a kind of, yeah, it was different, difficult. And you also have teaching acting experience. Tell us more about it. Yeah, it was, was wonderful. I was an acting coach nearly all around, and I was teaching to teenagers. Uh, I was prepared to teach them how to um, to acting, how to be in front of the camera, use the voice, and you know, this kind of stuff. But they teach me. They teach me some things of the life. And it was a beautiful experience because we teach each other. I believe you. And also you have like great connections here in the USA for voiceover. Share with us. Yeah, I give my voice for a lot of TV series, a lot of American TV series like um, Vampire Diaries, Little Pretty Liars, do you know? <laughs> and a um, movie called um, The Last Keepers. I was the main character, the lead. And um, was was super cool because oh, voicing over is very, very tough. So yeah, especially so. because besides you have to imagine yourself, you have to put yourself out there and imagine like in this studio and come up with all these wonderful things. Yeah, voices. you have to say, you, you don't move and you have to put all your emotions with another actor or actress. I mean, it's yeah, beautiful but tough. <laughs> so I have a game for you. I say a couple words and you also answer a couple words. Are you ready to play? Yeah. Okay, so today I am... Today I'm a powerful woman. Yesterday I was... Yes, I was improving my acting. Tomorrow I will be um, a beautiful mom and a well-known actress. <laughs> my favorite hobby is singing. Love it. <laughs> my favorite trip is. Oh, I don't have. I love to travel all around the world. Oh, so many places to explore. Yeah, so I many. Love it. And I always see all the seven seas. I miss one. That's it. I have to see. My hero is my parents. Supportive? Yeah, how they grew me. Wonderful. Yeah. What do you wish for the world? More love and peace, for sure. And peace is? Peace is love each other and don't fight again. Never, never. Hope is? Hope is difficult because hope is everywhere. Is in our soul. It's within ourselves, right? Yeah. Yes. Kiara versus Kiara. Oh, so many Kiaras in a Kiara. <laughs> <laughs> so, what message you want to leave for your followers? Guys, never give up and follow your dreams. Totally. Yeah, always. Kiara, thank you so much for being on our show today. You are such a wonderful person. No, you are. You are beautiful. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. And how can people contact you? Oh, they can find me on Facebook and Instagram, Chiara Basile Fazzolo. Uh, you can see all my histories all around the world and in Hollywood. Would you do a monologue for us? Yeah, sure. Yay! So, Chiara. the monologue is from Dirty Dancing and Francis, the leading role. Who doesn't know, right? Yeah. <laughs> It's a little bit tragic, but anyway. <laughs> I told you that. I told you I was telling the truth. I lied to you, but you lied too. You told me everyone was alike and deserved a fair break, but you meant everyone was like you. You wanted me to change the world, make it better. But you meant by becoming a lawyer or an economist and marry someone from Harvard? I'm not proud of myself, but I'm in this family too, and you can't keep giving me the silent treatment. There are a lot of things you don't know about me, but if you love me, you have to love me. In the way I have all the things about me. 
And I love you, Daddy. Love you so much. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I lied to you. <laughs> but you lied to. Now, would you sing for us? Yes! An Italian oh, famous wonderful song! Please! Mm, okay. <clears throat> Thank you. You're wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Hollywood, California. There's Hollywood, Florida, by the way. I know, right? Yeah. I figured this out like the recent. You see my boobs? He's like, <laughs> no, don't let her know. <laughs> see, this is behind the scenes, Chanel. <laughs> How do you guys like it? Like it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I don't know how my wow. voice can sing. Oh, my gosh. No, no, you, so you actually, I thought that you were more than able to do it. Wow. <laughs> you were on pitch. Wow. Right. Yeah, it was. Great. I think it was great. You did it as if like you weren't like you were feeling great. Yeah. You just went with it. Really? You don't yeah. feel I'm kind no, of sick? No, no, you 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 weren't uh, straining. You were on pitch. Right. I like, like it now the point, right? Okay. Okay. You were oh, got entertained for that? Super. Uh, entertainment was a good entertainment? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> good footage. One, two, three.